Hey everyone, today we'll talk about types of variables and regression versus classification models. So firstly, we have continuous variables. A continuous variable is something you can measure. So you could put it on this number line. An example could be weight in kilograms or maybe height in centimeters. And although this number line only shows positive numbers, negative numbers are allowed as well. Next up, we have discrete or categorical variables. Discrete and categorical are considered synonymous. A categorical variable is something that is one of multiple classes. One example could be you have the possible classes of either cat and dog. This is also called binary because it's just one or the other. There's two different classes only. We have a cat and a dog and you could have many other images, all of either cats or dogs. Nothing else is allowed. Another example could have more than two classes. Maybe it was the possible classes zero, one, two, up to nine. Instances of this categorical variable would be images that have a handwritten digit, which is either representing zero, one, two, up to nine again, and this one happens to be a five. This one's a zero, a one, a 9, and a 4. It turns out that for categorical variables, there is actually a small hierarchy. A categorical variable is either considered ordinal, which means there is an order, or nominal, which means there is not an order. So what do we mean by order? Well, let's look at nominal categorical variables first, which means no order. A possible example of this is the cat and dog example. There is no order between cats or dogs. They're just simply two very different animals. So again, nominal, there is no order to these classes. Now we'll compare these to ordinal categorical variables. And a good example would be the possible classes are small, medium, and large. And maybe we were referring to the size of a coffee. They could either be a small, a medium, or a large coffee. And so this is still categorical because it must be one of these three different classes. However, it is considered ordinal because there is an obvious ordering to these classes. Now we can talk about the types of supervised models. So as we know, a supervised learning model takes an input and predicts some output. If its output is continuous, we call it a regression model. So a regression model is something that predicts a continuous variable. If its output is categorical, we call it a classification model. So a classification model is predicting a categorical variable, which makes sense because there's multiple different classes. So again, a regression model is a model that predicts a continuous variable. Here's an example. We had some machine learning model, which I'm just representing as a green box for now. It takes some input. So this one is not taking the image of Bill Gates here. It's taking his weight of 61 kilograms. So that's going to be the input to this model. And hopefully it's learned to map this to its output. And we are trying to predict in this example, his height, which is 1.77 meters. This is called a regression model because the output is a continuous variable. Height is a continuous variable. Since this model is predicting it, we call it a regression model. Now an example of a classification model. Again, it's a model that predicts a discrete or categorical variable. It doesn't matter whether it's ordinal or nominal. So here we have another machine learning model, and this takes as input the image of this cat, and it's trying to figure out what image is actually represented here. We know it's cat, but we're hoping that the model learns to figure out on its own what is represented in this image. We're assuming this model has only taken images of cats or dogs, so its output, we hope it is cat, and we call it a classification model because cat or dog is a categorical variable. So in summary, we have that continuous variables are things that can be measured, whereas categorical variables fall into one of many classes. Categorical variables are either ordinal, they have an ordering, or nominal, they don't have an ordering. 
Regression is the problem of predicting a continuous variable, whereas classification is the problem of predicting a categorical variable. That's the end of this video.